example 3.4 or 4.4 for the given textbooks. For details, please see the description below. In this example, there is a rigid tank that contains 10 kilograms of water and 90 Celsius. Eight of those 10 kilograms is water in the liquid form and the rest is in the vapor form. Our tasks are to calculate the pressure and the volume for the given conditions. In order to start, we're going to plot a temperature specific volume plot. So we got temperature in Celsius. And then we have a specific volume, which is a meter cubed per kilogram. And then we're going to plot our given temperature, which is 90 Celsius. And then we're going to draw a saturated uh, pressure line like this. The conditions that we have are going to be a saturated mixture, so it's somewhere in between the saturated liquid and saturated uh, vapor uh, points. In order to get the conditions for the saturated mixture, we need to go to the saturated wa water uh, tables, which for uh, SI units are located in table A4. If we go over here into this table, we find the temperature of 90 Celsius, and we find that the saturated pressure is going to be equal to 70.185.83 kilopascals. Now, in order to find the volume, we need to find the two corners of the line, the saturated line, which is going to be the saturated liquid and the saturated vapor. This is the value for the saturated liquid specific volume. 0 0.001036 and then this is the value for the saturated vapor um, which is equal to 2.3593 both of them are a meter cube per kilogram once we have the value for the saturated liquid and saturated gas specific volumes we could find what is the value of the specific volume for this condition however before we do that we need to find the quality of this saturated mixture the quality could be found simply by doing the ratio of the mass of the vapor divided by the total mass of the system. In this case, the mass of vapor is equal to 2 kilograms and the total is equal to 10 kilograms. Therefore, the quality for this particular case is equal to 0.2. In order for us to find out the specific volume, we're going to use this formula, 1 minus x times the specific volume uh, for the saturated liquid plus quality and the specific volume for the gas. Once we substitute all these values that we have and the quality, we're able to find that the specific volume for this particular case is equal to 0.4727 meter cubed per kilogram. Now in order to find the actual volume that we have for this system we simply are going to take the specific volume that we found and we're going to multiply it by the total mass that we have in the system therefore the total volume that we have is going to be equal to 4.727 uh, meter cube 